Major Orisha Description and Attributes More Information Orisha's Other Names Orisha's Other Names Description and Attributes Image Earthly Homes and Sites Ori Ori is the universal household Orisha venerated by all in Yoruba land as the custodian of fate. Hence, Ori is propitiated or appeased that one may have good fate. When one has a balanced character, one obtains an alignment with one's Ori or divine self. The representing image of Ori is said to be 41 cowries strung together in the shape of a coronet or tiara, usually kept in a large coffer or enclosure called Isle Ori, Ori's house, made from the same material and is as large as the votary can afford slash want it to be. Symbol of the inner head, Ibori, Africa, Nigeria, Yoruba people, 19th to 20th century leather glass beads, cowrie shells, Dallas Museum of Art. Orunmala Agbenirgun. Ieliri Ipin. Ila, Benirgun. Ajana. Okedaviri, the Yoruba Grand Priest, Sage, and Custodian of the Ifa Oracle, source of knowledge who is believed to oversee the knowledge of the human form, purity, the cures of illnesses and deformities. Babalawos are Orumala subordinates as priests, devotees, and followers. The light or illumination of Ifa itself is referred to as Ila. Babalawos and Ayanifas invoke Ella's light when calling for Orunmala's presence. Orunmala is considered synonymous with or an avatar of Ila by many, and the name is often broken down as Orunmi Ila, meaning heaven brings forth revelation slash light. Therefore, Ifa, Orunmala, and Ella are all seen as aspects of the divine light which reveals things unknown, whether in the past, the present, or future. Thumb image. Adu Ekiti. Home. Isle Ife. Origin. Elegba. Leroy. Bara. Lalu. Ajari Oko. Odara. Latopa often ill-translated as the devil or the evil being. Eshu is in truth neither of these. Best referred to as the trickster, he deals a hand of misfortune to those that do not offer tribute or are deemed to be spiritual novices. Also regarded as the divine messenger, a prime negotiator between negative and positive forces in the body and an enforcer of the law of being. He is said to assist in enhancing the power derived from herbal medicines and other forms of esoteric technology. Eshu is the Orsha of chance, accident, and unpredictability. Because he is Oloran's linguist and the master of languages, Eshu is responsible for carrying messages and sacrifices from humans to the sky god. Also known for his phallic powers and exploits, Eshu is said to lurk at gateways, on the highways and at the crossroads, where he introduces chance and accident into the lives of humans. He is known by a variety of names, including Elibara. Thumb image. Ketu Benin. Home. Ijlu Ekiti. Home. Igbeti Oyo. Sight. Iwuro. Lagos. Sight. Arwit Grave Oko Ajanjal, the Orisha of agriculture, open fields, and morality, he was known to be a fighter against sorcery. He was a hunter who kept a dog and a flute credited with the development of agricultural practices. He is associated with the annual New Yam harvest. Honey bees are his messengers. Orisha Oko is represented with a large staff with rolls of copper, baba, strings wound around its handles, opa Orisha Oko, and a flute made of ivory. Thumb image. Ifa Osin. Home. Origin. Iro Oyo State. Home. Ogin Lakai. Alada Meiji. N. Email. Alagbita Orisha of Iron, War, Heroism, and Metallurgy. He is venerated by all those who work with metals and technology. Thumb image. Isle Ife Owen. Origin. Ayer Ekiti. Home. Ak Oyo. Associated. Bayani Dada. Ajaka. Bayonai Bayani or Dada Ajaka was a brother to Shingo and another son of Iranian. He was Alephin of Oyo before Shengo and again after him. He is the Orisha of birth, youngsters and children with natural hair of tufts that grow separately in tight curls, Dada, and is often associated with prosperity. By some accounts, Dada Ajaka was actually the brother to Shengo while Bayani was female and a sister. However, 
the domains of both personages have become largely intertwined. He is strongly associated with the Yawa slash Agbedo region, and his object is a diadem slash coffer of cowries with several strings with a tipped top, an ori, called Ade Bayani, Bayani's crown. Thumb image. Oyawao, home, origin. Yamoja Awoyo, Olodo. Mojilwu matron of the Ogun River that flows from the upper regions of Oyo State, Oak Ogun, through Ogun State and the city of Abiokuda, before emptying into the Lagos Lagoon, OSA. Other smaller tributaries and streams are dedicated to Ayamoja throughout Yorubaland, spiritual mother of Awith Gravenji. According to Alorishas, she is the amniotic fluid in the womb of the pregnant woman, as well as the breasts which nurture. She is considered the protective energy of the feminine force. Her name is derived from the words Yeomoeja, meaning mother of fish children, which is a metaphor for bodies of water with fish, including lakes and the ocean. Thumb image. Isle Yvette Owen State. Origin. Ak Oyo State. Home. Ibra, Abokuta, Ogun State. Site. Owen Ye. Ladakoju. Iwuji, a second wife of Shango, she is said to have entered into a river at Osagbo. The Yoruba clerics ascribed to her sensuality, beauty, and gracefulness, symbolizing both their people's search for clarity and a flowing motion. She is associated with several powers, including abilities to heal with cool water, induction of fertility, and the control of the feminine essence. Women appeal to her for childbearing and for the alleviation of female disorders. The Yoruba traditions describe her as being fond of babies and her intervention is sought if a baby becomes ill. Ashin is also known for her love of honey and crocodiles are her messengers. Items closely associated with Ashin are brass fans, a B, brass bells, aya, anklets and bangles, eyed, brass machetes, ada, brass hairpins, akodi, red parrot feathers, ikodied, and brass combs, Oyia slash Ia. Thumb image. Ejid Ekadi. Home source. Ejumu Kogi. Origin. Ogbo Osen. Grove. A with Grave Vanji Jakuta. Obakaso associated with virility, masculinity, fire, lightning, stones, Oyo warriors, and magnetism. He is said to have the abilities to transform base substances into those that are pure and valuable. He was the Oba of Oyo at some point in its history. He derived his nickname Obakaso from the tales of his immortality. Shango is the Orisha of the Thunderbolt, said to have ruled in ancient times over the kingdom of Oyo. Also known as Jakuta, Stone Thrower, and as Obakaso, the king does not hang. Citation needed. Thumb image. Oyo Isle. Home. Kaso, Quara. Sight. Aranal Ainal, a great hunter, fisherman, and water lord, Orisha, who had no wife and lived on the bank of the Aranal River. He is also known as a great healer. Some traditions credit him with starting the tradition of chanting Ijala, a traditional oral poetry with a characteristic nasal twang, mostly performed by hunters, and mostly associated with Ogun, due to his loneliness. He is represented by smooth black stones from the Aranal River, a tributary stream which empties into the Osun River Nereid, placed in an earthenware filled with water. His objects are a staff of wrought iron with prongs or branches surmounted by birds. Thumb image. Ajigbosi. Home. Oya Ayasin. Orari, the third wife of the one-time Oba of Oyo called Shango, she is also known to possess a fiery temper similar to Sango and is said to have entered into the river Niger. She is the deity of powerful winds, storms, and the tempest, guardian of the cemetery, storms, and transformation. She possesses the power to shape shift between human and animal forms and is closely associated with the African buffalo. She is also referred to as the mother of nine, Ayoezen, for the nine branches of the river. Due to her personal power and nature as a warrior goddess, she is usually depicted as being in the company of her husband, Shango. She is the Orisha of rebirth, citation needed. Thumb image. Ira, Ayun, Quora. Home. Okoro, A with Ray J with Rave, Benin. 
Aya Abessin Temple Osanian Aroanai Osanian is the most powerful deity of herbs with dominion over all those who deal with plants and magic. Represented as a one-eyed, one-handed, and one-legged figure, he is the Orisha of herbs, plants, magic, potions, charms, and healing. Osanian is often depicted as a homeopathic Orisha, meaning that he often takes the look or form of the ailment which it is invoked to treat or cure. He also represents the duality and balance of nature and the double facets of herbal power. That which can make you better can also harm you if used improperly or if abused. His object is the Osanian staff, Opa Osanian. The staff is composed of a circle of small birds and a shaft in the middle that elevates a large bird above smaller ones. Thumb image. Isaba, Ikalu, Ekadi State. Home, origin. Obalue Pana. Babalu I. Amalu meaning, Lord, ruler of the world, and a widely feared Orsha, he is also variously known as Safona, the deity of smallpox, Amalu or Satfata. As Obalue, he is the Orisha of diseases and sickness. While he has the power to inflict smallpox and other disease, he is also associated with the ability to heal those afflicted with these diseases. In the 20th century, Worship of Obalue was banned by the British colonial government as they were believed to purposely infect people with smallpox. Citation needed. Thumb image. Iwa Orisha of the Iwa River associated with cemeteries, clarity, beauty, dreams, and magic. She lives in the cemetery with Oba and Oya. She brings souls to her sister Oya meaning she is the initiator of the beginning of all change that occurs. Explicit or loud speech near her places of worship is not tolerated. There is also a pataki of how this Orisha was able to effectively trick death itself. Also Iwa cannot be venerated near Shango as according to the Patakis he molested her. Iwa is also responsible for gifting humans with dreams and imagination. Obatela R.A. with grave L.A. with acute. A. with grave L.F.N. Gryan. Oluwawai. Orimagbo also known as Orisha Enla slash Ashela, meaning the big Orisha, and Orisha Fun Fun, the white Orisha. He is also known as the Sky Father. He is often equated with purity, and represented by Allah, or white cloth, and Efun, white chalk. Most items associated with Obatela are either white or clear. He is regarded as the creator of earth and the shaper of the human body from clay. He is also known as the protector of the physically challenged slash different. His favorite consort was Yemoa, Yaimoa. At his iPhone abode, he is known by the name Ashaliophone, while in Ehigbo he goes by the appellation Ashajian slash Ashajirian, two popular avatars of Obatela. His offerings are the African land snails, Igbin. Thumb image. Odiranye, Ide Ta, Ife. Origin. Home. Underscore 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 underscore. Efo n un. Associated. Underscore 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 underscore. Ehigbo un. Associated. Aganju Aganjl roughly translating to darkness of the wilderness. Aganju is very closely related with Sango and is regarded as the Orisha of the forest, the desert, volcanoes, and the wilderness. He was originally a king of the Oyo Empire, c. Alephan Aganjusola, before being deified after his death. He is the patron deity of long-distance traveling, is said to walk with a sword in long strides as if leaping over obstacles, and said to fight by shooting fire, as opposed to Sango who fights with thunderbolts and lightning while hurling thunderstones, Edun Era. His object is a double axe similar to Sango's but with a longer handle. Oyo Isle Home. Oosio Wuzi. Ode Mi Tahi is the Orisha of adventure, hunting, and the forest, and is another patron of hunters. He is a master of archery, he is called the Archer of the Orisha, and is always depicted holding a bow and arrow often with a quiver, Apo. His power is made manifest in the speed and accuracy of his arrow and his prideful assertion of mental and physical dexterity. His object is a brass iron crossbow, a run, often with strings of cowries hanging down from it, and small iron cylinders filled with miniature arrows, Ofa. Thumb image. Ida. 
Olokan Malakan. Niata primordial force present at creation, Olokan, meaning owner of the ocean is also known as Imal Okan, deity of the ocean. Olokan had been present since the beginning of creation as an androgynous Orisha ruling the depths of the ocean and all the waters on earth before Obatela was supposed to come and create dry land. They are the parent of the Orishasaj and Oloese, and represents wealth, healing, and the vastness of the sea citation needed Isle Ife, Oun. Origin, Home. Ajay with grave LGA with acute. Ogyguloso not to be confused with Iyamiaj, he is also called Aj Saluga. Aj is the representation and the Orisha of wealth and economic success. He is also a patron of traders, business people, and markets. The Yoruba word for Monday, is called Aj as it is often the first day of the week when markets open. Citation needed. Otoju wa Olofin Adimula. N-O-R-A. Olofin I regarded as the founder of the Yoruba people and the first Oba of Ife, he is also associated with an androgynous Orisha of creation. Most Yoruba people, and their monarchs most especially, claim descent from Otojuwa. He is a father or grandfather of Oranmian, Sango, Ajaka, Obalufon, and other Obas of Ife. He is also regarded as an ancestor of the Obas of the Benin Empire. He is the Orisha of the earth and the initiator of the Ogboni which started from the sacred city of Ife and are charged with the maintenance of social order. Oak ORA. Origin, home. Underscore 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 underscore. I'll Ife. Home. Obeyabu the first and most senior wife of Shango, she is the Orisha of the Oba River, and also is the Orisha of domesticity, energy, movement, and the flow of time and life. She is most known for being tricked by the other wives of Shango into cutting off her ear and attempting to feed it to her husband Shango. Thumb image. Close.